All right, here we are on the Sea Ray 240 Sundancer, starting out here in the cabin. And uh, you've got the V berth up here, and you've got your table option uh, right under that cushion, and there's storage under each of these cushions. Uh, you've got a pedestal post there where you can put the table or you can put a filler cushion. And that filler cushion is located in this locker here. You see it's folded in half. And then there's the two posts. One's for the table in the uh, cockpit. And the other's for the table or the uh, berth uh, inside here. Okay. Uh, air conditioning controls are over here. No, there it is. All right, I'm not on power right now. Uh, the boat is in a rack, so I can't turn that on. But uh, here's your galley. You got a microwave. You got a refrigerator. You got your steps up to the deck. You've got a head uh, with the porta potty in it, sink, shower, shower curtain. You got a little storage underneath. Um, then we've got the uh, the full berth uh, back under here. There's some supplies, some swimming supplies and stuff under there now. Um, here is your galley again. Like I said, microwave. He's got the Sea Ray bag uh, with all the manuals. And of course, that's storage once you take a Sea Ray bag out of there. And you've got a single burner oven. Uh, you've got your uh, ACDC panel there. you got your stereo. Um, it's got a sunshade in here to keep the uh, UV rays from tearing up the interior. So, looks pretty good. We'll go step out into the uh, deck. I'll uh, give you a warning, it is a little dirty. So, uh, please look past the dirt. So anyway, here's your rear seating position. You've got your bar there, and then you've got your helm. you got dual bimini's, so that's uh, one up there. And you got another one back here. Uh, we've got two seats to port. And your driving position. There's a fold down uh, thigh rise bolstered seat, uh, basic dash, and then you've got the, uh, the rolling stepped door for the cabin and uh, the glass that opens up to get you out on the deck there. You got a nice bow rail out there so you can suntan without feeling like you're going to fall overboard. All right, and then the engine is. Uh, is under this big compartment. So let's pull that up. Ah. And I did that one hand, so it's very easy to get to. There's your engine compartment. Merc 5.0 MPI. Five suppression system. You got a hot water tank. Get your fuel tank down there. Uh, battery. Battery charger. And then there's that gray bag right there. I don't know if you can see that, that gray bag right there is, uh, that's either the carpet that snaps in back here or the uh, part of the enclosure for the cockpit. It's probably the enclosure for the cockpit, but it's all rolled up in that bag. Okay, so I'm going to drop this platform here. There you go. And then there's the post where uh, the table can go for drinks while you're sitting back here. And then you've got your uh, swim platform back here with the lazarette, some storage back there, lots of storage back there. You got your hookup for your shore power and water and even cable TV. Okay, so there she is. Uh, sea Ray 240. Boat name is Freedom. And uh, we'll step down and take a look at the outside next. All right, starting out here at the underside, we've got our Mo Cruiser Bravo 3 Outdrive, uh, dual prop, kind of rotating props. You got trim tabs back here. There's a nice swim ladder. Name of the boat again is Freedom. Um, looking from the, the side here, there she is. She's got some. Uh, Stains on the hull that come off with hull cleaner very easily. It's the water here that does that. But uh, great looking boat. And there she is. 
All right, here is the trailer uh, that goes with the Sea Ray 240 Sundancer. And it is a big, uh, heavy duty, all aluminum, uh, magic tilt trailer. You got some new covers on the bunks. Two uh, large, heavy duty axles with four brakes. Looks to be in good shape, roadworthy. Uh, he said he's used it uh, many times, no problems. 